Okay, so I clearly made a video talking about how um, relationships dynamics don't work. And one of the things I said in there was that my grandparents, you know, work things out. And I do understand that there are some people who didn't grow up watching that. Again, guys, I watched that what, until I was 16. Then my grandpa passed away. I had to live with my mom who was toxic in and out of relationships, literally on drugs, crazy, whatever, toxic as fuck. And that's what I got to see. So I've seen both sides of the spectrum. I even got some of my mom's toxic ways in the process of it. But you guys, to me, in a non-disrespectful way, I'm just straight up, I can't lie. What, what's the excuse? How long are you going to keep going? My parents, I, I, my parents were dysfunctional. So what? That's like saying you got bullied your whole life and you're going to go bully people. When are you going to change? People want all the blame to be on other people, but no one ever looks in the mirror. When you leave the nest, it is your job to change everything about yourself. If you don't do that, that's on you. And the fact that there are so many ways to help yourself nowadays and people still don't utilize these resources, that is on you guys. Do the self work. There are all these fucking videos on how to love a man, how to love a woman. And if you don't have one, they're on my fucking YouTube. On top of that, do the self-work, go to the gym, heal, go to therapy. If you don't want therapy, journal, meditate. Everything that your family taught you that was fucking toxic, break that shit down until you make yourself a whole new man, a whole new woman. If I could do it, you could do it. I've been abused, homeless. My mom left me out on the street. I watched my mom cheat. Did I do all that stuff? No, I became the total opposite of what my mom was. So when people give me this, oh, nah, 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 excuses, and I'm not saying him because I do feel bad for people who have dysfunctional families, but it's your job to heal. I don't know how many, you're going to be 60 talking about my mom, this, what bro? Like, <laughs> and I'm not talking about him guys. I'm just saying in general, because a lot of people in my comments are doing this and I'm looking at their page and they're like way older than me. And the fact that I'm 27 years old and I'm fucking healing and I'm doing so much better in life than most people, you could fucking do it too, dude. I don't want to hear it. I'm sorry. There's certain things I don't excuse anymore. Like, it's, it's your job to do the work. If you want to change something, you'll fucking fix it. Just like people want new cars, the latest shit that's out, y'all be going to the hell and back to get it. But you won't go to hell and back for yourself. Please get the fuck out of here. And the last thing I want to add, please listen to this. If you do not uh, take advice from somebody, fuck their criticism. Like if you have toxic parents or parents who didn't care about you or parents who didn't care about each other and you see their relationship going into shit, why would you ever want to do things like them? That's why I say change. Because in order to change and be a better parent in the future or a better partner, you have to work and fix your traumas and all the things that you were once bad at. How long are you guys going to make this excuse my parents? Exactly. Do better.